Jane Hilaire Orbain the 10th of November 1912 the 16th of August 1989 was a Gabonese politician active during both the colonial and independence periods. The French journalist Pierre Payne said that Orbain's training as a practicing Catholic and a customs official helped to make him an integrated man, one of whom political power was not an end in itself. 3. Born into a Fang family, Orbain was orphaned at a young age. He was raised by the stepbrother of Leon Bab, who became Orbain's chief political rival. Encouraged by his colleagues, Orbain entered politics, serving as Gabon's first representative in the National Assembly of France from 1946 to 1958. Orbain was also a leader in solving African problems, particularly developing the Gabonese standard of living and planning urban sites. Orbain's quick rise in Gabonese politics was spurred by the support of the missions and administration, whereas much of Mba's strength came from the colonists. Despite a rivalry, Orbain and Mba, now the president of Gabon, formed several political unions which were sufficiently politically balanced to appeal to the electorate. In appreciation for his help, Mba appointed Orbain as foreign minister and later president of the Supreme Court. Tensions soon rose between the two due to Orbain's refusal to merge his party with Mbaz and create a one-party state for Orbain was installed as president of Gabon during a 1964 coup dated against Mbaz. However, the coup was toppled three days later, and although he did not participate in the coup's planning, Orbain was sentenced to ten years of hard labor and ten years of exile. He was beaten almost daily by his prison guards, while serving out his sentence. Mba's successor as president, Omabongo, allowed the return of Orbain to Gabon in 1972. The elder politician died in 1989 in Gabon's capital of Libreville.